Thank goodness. This is our secret base. We have been preparing the remaining Amazon forces since Navarro attacked the Citadel. Oh! We chased after the kidnapped prince during the Navarlan assault, but... Unfortunately, we stumbled into the Somnosa Meadow and succumbed to the sleep spores. Once the wind blew the spores away, we awoke to a cold trail and the citadel burning in the distance we have failed you and prince elliot please i am simply happy that you are alive thank you your highness once your companions are awake please come to the meeting room everyone wishes to see you captain Well, they obviously woke up and left while in the middle of that conversation, because they're out of bed now. That, again, let's loot the place. There are no little cactus sightings in here, but I'll see if I can step outside really quick. Oh, hi, Charlotte. Can't fall these mountain paths. Even I'm getting dizzy up here. We could have entered there er, before. And unfortunately, after, getting, after passing out from some, most of the flowers once, nope, they never fix you again. Uh, nice immune system you guys uh, have got. Put, put, put. Huh? I don't want to come up here. And there you are, a little cactus sighting. Yep, occasional double experience. So that's the first of the really good prizes. I guess you could argue the 10% discount is also a good one, but we'll get better ones later on. So it's, it's just a nice build-up. Uh, in terms of uh, double experience, I think, it, I think it's got like a 20% chance of happening after a battle. Anyway, back into the base. Just, just good to get that little cactus now because there's no really good time to get him later. And hey, Angela's right here too. Is anyone else worried to have somebody some gnosis nearby? I guess I finally got a good night's sleep, but come on! Citadel Laurent is known to be impenetrable, surrounded by crags and harsh winds to protect it. Retaking it will not be an easy feat. I do not know if we will succeed. Well, if we don't succeed, uh, know oh, that your treasure has fallen into good hands. Oh, game wants us to die. Expects, expects us to die. I mean, I've not bought any items at all. So I'm just finding so many. We will take back the Citadel. The meadow near our base is filled with some flowers. Do not worry. You become immune to their sleep spores after being exposed to it once. And here's a nice uh, world map. It, a nice touch would have been to uh, just be able to examine it closer. A little shiny spot. Hey, three sockets! Finally, enough to share. And nope, just the uh, Navarro prisoners. But just uh, we captured an agent in the meadow. He's behaving oddly. I do not know how the Navarro's managed to take the Citadel in this state. But yet yeah, they say nothing. I should have come here first because now we can head to the meeting room. There will be a tactical meeting regarding our next move in that room there. Oh, looking on tactical meeting. Your Highness, I am so pleased to see you well. 
Please, do not strain yourself. <laughs> I am fine, child. How can we take the Citadel from the thieves who have it overrun? A frontal attack would easily be rebuffed by Navarro. Is there any way? Forgive me, I am a mere caretaker. I never learned tactics or strategies of war. <laughs> Wait. We should consult with the sage Dom Perry. He may have wisdom to impart upon us. Dom Perry? Yes! Back when the world was waging war on the Dragon Lord and his unstoppable forces. Tom Perry advised the Hero King on strategy, which led Valsena to victory. Where can we find this tactician? Hmm. He is difficult to locate. Dom Perry is Cora Poker. They are small, reclusive beings that dwell in Rabbite Forest, south of Jan. Then we must go and find him. Please wait! The Cora Poker do not like larger folks such as us. You may not be able to meet with him at all. So, what do we do? Hmm. Dom Perry may not agree to meet with you in your current forms. You must appear less human and more... Or a poker like. You must find the legendary minor mallet. Rumor has it that the item is in Bizer. With it, you could possibly pass for Cora Pokers. So, for an old guy who really didn't know much, he sure gave us a lot of information. So, yep, we gotta head back to Bizer. And, and the minor mallet is in the night market. It's being sold by that old woman, so. It's uh, not as much of a fetch quest, because if we had to find a legendary harp to recall the memories of an ocean to obtain a ship, we're playing the wrong game. It's not nearly anything like that. Hey! This way! Now, if you haven't gotten a little cactus, this is uh, another good time to do so. I just. Uh, I just went ahead and did so right away because it's actually easy to miss him if you're focusing on walking over here. Oh my! Is that Von Voyage's cannon? Oh! You know my cousin? The name's Messi. Nice to meet you! Will this cannon reach Pfizer? And why do no one in your family have French accents? But of course! Are you ready? Yep! I mean, it's free after all. Whatever it doesn't kill us only makes us stronger. And it's nice of them to shoot us out in party order. Yeah, and having characters suddenly uh, land in the middle of the city, you think we were under assault or something like that. Nope! You may notice that Reese and Angela have the exact same animation. Should we try that night market we keep hearing about? I was gonna just use a dream read. Perhaps we should wait in the inn until then. But uh, since uh, we do need to refill Angela's MP, perfect time for a rest. Yep, uh, I'll wait. Welcome. Now, since it's mana day, I did get the free stay at the inn. All right. Back outside. And, well, it doesn't look dark in here at all. So, the... Of course, uh, we want to get the Miter Mallet right away, but we want to talk to the Aurora Sister first. Aurora Sister, famed entertainers of the night market. Shall we dance for you? Yeah, I'll say yes.
I mean, they had the models, they might as well have animated them. So, the thought of the Aurora Sisters has granted you a new ability. With that, we get the Magic Switch. Increase the magic attack by 5% in battle. So, a good one to have for Angela or Charlotte. And we also want to talk to this one with Reese in the party. Looking for labor? Ah, now normally I'd offer you a deal on indentured servants, but uh, I'm sold out. Someone already bought the last bratty boy I had. And that kid <laughs> had a few screws loose. Kept saying he was a prince or something. Talking to the wrong person and, and saying that. What? That boy might very well have been Elliot. Where is he now? You knew him? Duh. Sorry, but the man just bought the wares and left. I didn't pry, well, since business is business. <laughs> oh, have mercy. I, I, I sold the kid to a red-eyed man. <laughs> That's all I know, I, I swear. Good thing the camera's not showing her death glare. I cannot let this go. People's lives are not good to be bartered. You should be ashamed! Now change your ways or I'll talk at you some more! Uh, yes, ma'am! Understood! <laughs> I will change my wicked ways! Just please spare me! She gave him a real tongue lashing. Ugh. Red eyes. And Traders of Repentance has granted you a new ability! So start at down resistance! 20% chance of casting all allies stat decrease. All allies. So very good for support roll. I'm gonna give that to, give that to Charlotte later on. And otherwise, well, we got the medallion over there. But even more importantly, treasure over here. Oh, 500 lucre. That'll pay for our next uh, voyage. Oh, welcome. Looking for something in particular? I always wanted to set up shop like this. Lady, who flattened your face? Uh. Running a shop isn't as fun as I thought. Well, enjoy your doodads. I, I think I'll go take a nap. Oh, so, yep, easiest fetch quest ever. <laughs> We haven't finished shopping first, Fairy. Let's see what the, in the Welcome. See what we got. So, yeah, these are unique uh, items, only available in the night market, or you can grow them from item seeds, as well as I can't get from enemy drops. For pretty much, these are meant to balance out your party if you don't have the uh, if you don't have similar skills. So, coin steal, uh, elemental damage to enemies, claws imbue allies' weapons with the elemental damage. And, of course, the chips, boost allies, magic, attacks, and defense, other stats. I probably don't need to use any of these. Because I do intend to have a... Yahoo! Nope. Let's be off to Rabbite Forest and find the Korriburger Village. So there, there I was talking about if the if the conversation's not over, it'll restart after uh, after a setting. People's lives are 100% density. Your future's already decided. There's no hope. Don't bother. You know, you can always reset your trading points and try again. It'll cost you, though. <laughs> so who wants their points reset? So, oh... If you want to reset your trading points, reallocate your stats. I see, a bunch of time wasters. Is that it? This is the place to do so. Not overly necessary unless you royally screw up. Which is almost impossible to do. So you don't sell anything, and one more merchant over here. Welcome. Lots of wares to browse. And of course we've got the usual uh, well, healing items and support items. But for the most part. Uh, the poto oil or, uh, or poto oil, good good ones to have if you don't have a good if you don't have a good healer. Uh, since we do have Charlotte, I'm not too worried right now. I may come and buy some stuff off screen just for later. For now, we're done here. Coming aboard. Yeah, it's not like it's still occupied or anything, right? Let's hear what everyone has to say first. Heading off into sea in the middle of the night. I am relieved we managed to find the minor mallet. 
We must hurry to Rabbi Forest and find Dom Perry. I've always wondered what Cora Pokers are like. <laughs> Sounds fun. Yeah, we'll just skip the rest of this. And hey, remember that treasure chest we skipped a long time ago? Finally got it. And yep, game still expects us to die. But now that the Beastmen have left, since they couldn't invade Wendell, they just went home. But hey, apparently, little cactus sighting. Oh, number 12. Now, oh, if you are playing this for the first time, you have one opportunity to miss Little Cactus before a long stretch where you cannot find him again. So you want to get to 15 before or finishing the Gust Hall dungeon. And for the most part, they aren't too hard to, too hard to find. You just have to go a little, a little out of your way at times. And I'm looking for my other party members to talk to them in here. So you talk to you talk to the residents of town, they'll just tell you the Beastmen went home. So I saved you time on that one. Wow, this town is nice and wively. Not as much as Wendell, but still. And Angela, are you in bed in the inn again? And, no, oh, she's not. So once again, we are trying to track down Angela before moving on. How did I know I'd find her at the bar? Oh good! The town's really bounced back now the beastmen are gone! Well, on the downside, the, the beastmen were actually doing everyone a favor. You may be wondering what that is. Well, that is a unique dialogue available maybe with at least Angela and Charlotte at the party but I think it requires the all-girl party to get that but yeah you may notice the enemies are much higher level now little cactus sighting And we already got most of the treasure here, but I will be taking a side trip back to Astoria as well as the lakeside where we met Fairy. Because, well, no cactus. And quick save. Yeah, since the enemies here are much higher level, I figured that the beast man and must have been taking out the high level ones and leaving the and the low level ones just alone because it weren't strong enough for a fight. They aggro us from quite a ways away. Oh, I don't have a class strike available. Oh, I thought we were done. <laughs> uh, experience could be better. And it thinks we're back at the start of the game because we're getting the tutorial message again. Oh, no, we're not poisoned. It's time to talk to Dom Perry. No, yes. it's not. I must release Laurent from Navarro's clutches. No, it's not. It's time to find little cactus. Okay. Earned a rest. I should get a level up before er, finding Dom Perry. But first of all, again, head back into the ruins of Astoria. So a couple things here. Well, of course we got the party members out and about. 
It's horrifying. No matter where you look, why did the beastman have to do this? But, of course, here's our little cactus sighting. And find one more for prize. And Charlotte, uh, you over here. Of course, there's only one other dot. But, nope, not Charlotte. Or she turned into a dog. We didn't notice. So, it doesn't seem to want to leave. But, the thought of the dog has granted you a new ability. Narrow escape. 50% chance of canceling stat decrease. So, even better than uh, what that uh, trader could have given us. But, uh, this is actually very easy to miss. Because, who thinks to come back to Astoria? Anyway, where's Charlotte? Down here. I used to play here all the time when I was younger. Yep, yeah, it's not easy. Yep, all we can do is move on and not let something like this happen again. And to do that, we need to get stronger. To do that, we need to get double experience. So let's find a little cactus one more time. Fight these guys, get the another level up. This is strength. I yep. can make a difference. And let's see, yep, got it. Gotta go all the way to the edge of the lake. Ah, uh, that is a terrible grouping. Well fought, well fought. I feel like I could defeat any enemy. Repeat clip, repeat clip. Okay, we got to level up, so let's uh continue on. Hey! Plot convenience! Of course, if the little people were into, we're actually called the Minish for playing the wrong game. But rather than chase after him, just completely let him get away, and now uh, we'll run from this one. Because little cactus sighting. He's enjoying the view. Can't blame him. This is a beautiful lake. So there's our occasional old double boost to experience. That'll make getting to level 18 in the next dungeon significantly easier. Oh yeah, look at this. So let me let me pull up the map and so time need to escape from battle now. Have another really good one, especially if you are playing through the game quickly on a new game plus. And while I'm thinking about it, one thing I never showed is oh, not that uh, push the triangle button or white button on an Xbox controller. Yeah, it brings up the character stats like this and. I just kept trying to show it off until now. But let's, uh, let's see if we can get a double experience boost. Because we will get uh, just a little cactus notification saying, yep, double experience. And it gets insane. Because in New Game Plus, you unlock an option to get triple experience. And on top of little cactus bonuses, yeah, you gain levels like crazy. Okay, well, we'll, we'll see it sooner or later. <laughs> I like that one. And hey, yeah, can we get in there? Nope, we gotta gotta examine the statue. Huh? You didn't do that before. Will this actually make us smaller? 
Uh, you completely missed there, Reese. Yep, got to examine on the little one. Or experiment on the little one. I'm the, I'm the youngest of three brothers. Yeah, I know how it feels. 